And now, a fireside story with Yeti. Uh, a tale of fast food by Fuyuhiko on QuoteV.com. It was a midsummer evening. Sunlight pierced its way through the crack of the curtain, allowing just enough light into the room. The young man sat at a table, took a sip of pure black coffee. <laughs> That was way too hot for anyone to be able to drink without their organs and throat burning. The man smiled to himself, when suddenly a thought crossed his mind. I could make a fast food restaurant with a clown as the mascot. And thus McDonald's was born. Ronald woke up. Oh no, I'm late for fast food school, Ronald shouted got out of the bed and dressed in his epic animu school outfit, and off he ran down the stairs. Late again, the CEO of McDonald's, also Ronald's father, asked. Ronald glared at him, muttering a, shut the <coughs> up, dad, and he got some toast out of the toaster, shoved it in his mouth, and ran to school. Ah, fast food school. An amazing and wonderful school for the elite. It was very hard to get accepted. It took a lot of effort and you had to study a lot to even get close to, pass to a passing score on the test. Hey, Ronald! Wendy shouted, running up to him as he entered the school. I see you're into cross-dressing again. <laughs> I thought you got over that. She wiggled her eyebrows so much that they turned into a Lenny face. Ronald blushed. Shut up! I wear whatever I want, Baka! He shouted, all cinderay like Suddenly, Big Burger Boy Benny, aka Burger King, walked by them. Suddenly, Big Burger Boy Benny, aka Burger King, walked by them. He was the most popular boy in school. He was the hottest boy and bugest boy you've ever seen. He was even growing a beard. God was his stubble attractive meant most of the people in the school wanted to rub against that stubble, including Ronald, but he would never admit that, ever. Wendy fucking hated that burger bitch. Wendy hated that burger. He was all over everyone at school and she knew that Ronald had like the biggest animu crush on him ever, and that just peeved her off more. Ronald, you need to be stopped sewing thirsty for that man you she whisper yelled. Ronald looked at her like she was Jack in the Box, which she was, lol, and blushed. Bro, 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 I do not like him. She, he spouted out, stuttering like crazy. Wendy rolled her eyes. You're so dumb, she spoke. You want to ride his... Ronald screamed and ran away. Time skip. Now Ronald was sobbing in the bathroom. He wasn't sad or anything, though. Lol. What, you thought he was getting bullied or some crap? There was dust in his eyes. Wendy. She thinks it's funny to wipe a feather duster all over my face. So he just sat on the toilet and called his dad to come and get him. But sadly, his sobbing filled the bathroom with his disgusting crying noises. Ah, finally. The bathroom. A loud voice boomed. I thought I would have to piss myself. Ronald stood and peeked over the top of the stool. It was Burger King 111. And he was naked. <laughs> Actually, he wasn't. But Ronald likes to imagine him naked. <laughs> anyway, so Ronald just kept sobbing in the bathroom. And Big Burger Ben went and took a piss. And he finally became concerned about the sobbing. Hey, by the way, who's crying in here? Go do that in your mom's car, lol. Now Ronald was actually sad. He didn't have a mom. He only had his dad because the CEO of McDonald's was the one who birthed him. Suddenly, there was a knock on the bathroom door. Hey, uh, is someone in there? Ben spoke. Are you okay? Ronald could not speak. He was way too flustered by the fact that Big Burger Ben suddenly kicked open the door 
I said, are you okay? Big Burger Boy Benny shouted. Ronald sat there like, huh? While well, he's sobbing, and Benny realized that, and was like, oopsie. So he walked into the store. Hey, who you be? Ronald was shook that Big Burger Boy Benny was speaking to him. Uh, I'm Ronald. Ronald stared out, looking at this big, beautiful man. Burger King Benny laughed. Lol, lol, I know you. You're Mickey D, right? Ronald shook his head. Uh, no. Mickey D is a... <laughs> I can't say that. <laughs> Mickey D is a... With blue hair that smells like fish? Burger Boy Benny reached towards Ronald. You don't smell like fish, you smell like burgers, lol. But bad, my burgers are the best. McDonald's would argue, but damn did Ronald love that man too much to tell him he was wrong about anything ever. You know, you're kinda hot like a spicy chicken sandwich with jalapenos, Big Burger Benny said. Ronald was taken aback. He was going to do something to him in a bathroom store? Suddenly, Big Burger Benny's lips were all up on Ronald's, and that boy was all blushy again. He kissed Big Burger Benny back, and then Wendy came in and nose bled to death. Rest in peace, Wendy. You're my boyfriend now, Ronnie.